Welcome to the Austin Method, where we help you develop the skills of square dancing. This segment is called Behind the Scenes. This is where we share things with you other than the skills we're already sharing in the Austin Method. Okay, so, so here's the deal. This one's going to be really short. Don't do drugs and don't drink before or during square dancing. Square dancing is already hard. Should be obvious by now that it takes concentration and focus and attention to get through square dancing, to get it right, to get to where you need to be, to get back home. So square dancing is hard. It's already hard enough without being impaired. So as a rule, we don't do drugs, we don't drink while we're square dancing. Yeah, you might be on drugs, prescription drugs for something, and they might inhibit you somewhat, make you dizzy or whatever. If it's significant enough, then you're just going to have to skip the square dancing. Otherwise, you know, whatever. But all that being said, Square dancers are not teetotalers. They're not party poopers. We've got some pretty good after parties, so we'll see you at the after party. Make sure to like and comment before you go. This is the way YouTube tells other people that you found this material engaging one way or the other. Comments are always appreciated. Likes and shares, of course, are much appreciated. And remember, However well-informed and carefully considered they may be, the opinions expressed here are solely my opinions and don't necessarily reflect the opinions of others involved in this production. Thank you for visiting the Austin Method. We hope to see you on the dance floor soon.